the tail, we want to take short under, underneath the tail and the coat is always longer on the top of the tail because this shortens the dog up. Okay? We're going to blend all this furnishings in underneath the tail to shorten him up even more and we want a nice straight front. So the first thing I think I'll do is I'll do the tail Good boy Oscar. Turn around so I can see. Good boy. Hold it very gently by the the hair on the end of the tail, not by the bone because they won't like it and they'll just sit down. Gently ease the coat out with taking your comb from the bottom to the top. All right? Now, Oscar's tail is too short. A Wester's tail should be at least six or seven inches, so we're going to have to <coughs> try and make it look a little bit longer. I like to use a, a slightly longer scissor when I do the tail because think you get a better finish. We want to trim an inverted carrot shape so it's wider at the base going up into a rounded tip. Okay we don't want a point, we don't want to see the end of the tail and I want to leave it quite long on, on the end there so that we give it the illusion of looking longer so it comes into the balance with, with the rest of him. So quite short on the base of the tail. Then <coughs> what we want to do is do these two lines either side of the tail, wider at the base, coming up into a rounded carrot shape. It does pay dividends to spend a little bit of time on this tail because it, it can change the whole appearance and balance of the dog. I think there's nothing worse than you, you I see Westies and somebody's clippered the tail and some Westies have these very long thin thin boned tails and they look just so out of, out of balance to me set the tail into the body bring the tail level with the body and blend it in to the body line as I say, Oscar's got quite a low set tail. It's actually down there. <laughs> and this is a little old fat. He's a little old man, but we're going to disguise that. You won't even see it. I think this is what good trimming's all about, really. It's, it's making the best of what you've got. Be it a little pet, I still like them to look the best they can. After all, if you're a professional groomer, these little dogs are walking adverts for you. And I know all of us do hundreds and hundreds of Westies. Well, I do hundreds of Westies. But I'd really love trimming them. I think they're a joy to trim Westies. So we're going to round the tip off. As I say, we don't want a point. 